Welcome back. This is Titanium Rhino, and we are here with another episode of Somerset on ESO. Last we checked, or last last time on last video rather, we had just finished up saving the two Sapiarch Sentinels for the College of Sen uh, Sapiarchs. After doing that, we talked to the Right Master, who said he had a memory of going into the dream caves or dreaming cave and opening a portal so that's where we're at now we're meeting him down in the dreaming cave we're underneath the uh kapora tower right now about ready to go into the dreaming cave so let's go ahead and continue on this quest and see what we have going on oh, this is cool Oh, there he is. Gandalf just came out. Here we can open paths to other realms. This particular path is blocked by Daedric magic. I have an idea, though. Take the Dawnstar gem from your pack and hold it up to the barrier. I do not meet the requirements. Okay. Oh, there we go. Just as I surmised, the barrier, it withdraws from the Dawnstar's power. Okay, so what now? Dawnbreaker's gem contains a portion of Meridia's power, but on its own it isn't strong enough to dispel this barrier. We need to find the Dawnbreaker's sword and make it whole once more. But they were pulled into Mephala's realm. We know that at least one Daedric Prince has attempted to help us against the triad of Vile, Mephala, and Nocturnal. I think it's time to approach Meridia and solicit her help in this endeavor. How do we get in contact with the Daedric Prince? We need to locate a true believer, one of Meridia's cultists. If anyone can direct us toward Daedric activity on Somerset, it's Lathan. Talk to Lathan. See if you can convince him to help us find one of Meridia's priests. I doubt that's going to happen. Why can't we use the Dreaming Cave to contact Meridia? As we've seen, the triad of Daedric Princes was able to interfere with the Golden Knight's efforts to reach us. If I attempt to use the Dreaming Cave to contact Meridia, chances are they'll notice and stop us. We can't risk tipping our hand just yet. And the barrier blocks access to the portal anyway. The barrier doesn't block every possible path. Only the one that I saw in my scribe memory. The path that leads to where I hid the heart of transparent law. As Katora's magic continues to fade, I believe my memories will return in time. What about the other sea slodes? Can the, can't the Abyssal Cabal replace Katora's magic? I don't think so. Each member of the Cabal possesses a unique talent. Katora dealt in mind magic. When you killed him, that magic was lost to the Cabal. No. Now we must concern ourselves with the Triad of Daedric Princes. All right, where can I find Lathan? Just as you were a tomb so you could travel to and from our tale, we use the same magic to prevent Lathan from leaving the island. He is free to wander where he will. But he can't leave. I believe he's outside, talking to Valsary. And you really think he'll help us? Nathan was a good man. I have to believe he still is, despite pledging his allegiance to Mafala and the court of Bedlam. Besides, we need to contact Meridia. He's our best chance for getting in touch with one of her priests. All right, let's go ahead and go talk to him then. Thought there was going to be a little bit more down here. That's a fancy looking kitty. All right. All right, Lathan. Where are you at? All the way over there? No problem. can't believe I had to find you and drag you back. Was our time together really so terrible? You still don't understand. Our daughter will never again see this view. Or hold my hand. Or... Or... Anything. 
Okay. I suppose it's too much for a prisoner to expect a few moments of solitude with his thoughts. Ah, oh, well. Got a so, spider on his belt buckle. What can I do for you? Has the right master sent you to interrogate me? Doesn't he trust my wife's talents in that regard? Where or is there a Meridia cult on Somerset? What a curious question. Do you actually believe that all Daedric cultists know each other? <laughs> yes. I hate to disappoint you, we don't. Although I can tell you that there are a lot fewer of the Lady of Life's followers now than there were before. What do you mean by that? The Court of Bedlam has been actively eliminating the competition, as it were. Oh, I wasn't Some crazy pauldrons. Involved. But I have it on good authority that the Meridia Shrine, hidden to the north of Shimmerine, has been disposed of. The court killed all Meridia's followers or, on Somerset? Who can say? I imagine that one or two of them scurried down a dark hole before the blade fell. Like rats her followers are. I believe I have said everything I'm going to on this subject. Now shove off. I guess I could go search around north of Shimmerine. That's oh. a wild Nixad chase. Didn't Razum Dahl mention he was investigating Daedric cults on Somerset? Maybe you should go talk to him. Maybe Razum you should mind your own has business. Been investigating Daedric activity across Somerset. He's your best chance for finding a follower of Meridia, despite what Lathan has intimated. Do you know where Razum Dahl is? The Eye of the Queen was in Shimmerine, conducting his own investigation into the Court of Bedlam and other Daedric activity. If anyone in Somerset can point you to a priest of Meridia, it's Razumdar. All right, then. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. How did I survive? Oh, that's crazy. Um... Hey, there's a chest. What do you know about that? Hey, somebody just... Somebody else jumped off and fell. Or fell and died. <laughs> Sucks to be you guys. What's down here? Did I miss something? Seem to be a lot of people over here. Hey, another chest. Not too shabby. Accidentally fall down here and get a couple chests. I don't think I need to go that way. All right. Anyways, come on, Cinder. You guys are just down here fishing. All right. Coliseum of the old ways. I'll come back and do that some other time. For now, I'm going to go find Razum Dar. Hopefully not fall off any other cliffs. I realize this probably wasn't the most direct route, but it's still scenic and pretty, and I'm going to keep doing this keep going this way. Where did... Oh, there it is. I lost my way shrine there for a second. Alright, Razumdar. Coming to you. Said Shimmerine. I imagine we probably got to be reaching around the halfway point on this main quest. 
now that we're, I guess this is the sixth video, which puts us around, oh, I don't know, four and a half, five hours worth of gameplay just working on main quest stuff. It is pretty cool, though. I like all the the new aesthetics. The island, the armors that we see, the robes. really like the robes. I wish I could get those. I'm, <laughs> I'm kind of a collector of outfits and games. Even if I don't wear them, I just like collecting them. I remember in Fable... I went through and collected every single outfit. <clears throat> Never really wore many of them, but I, I just like to have them. If the Queen's Eye wants to chase his own tail by following Skeeva scribblings, fine by me. Anything to keep him out of our business. Step away from that scribble, newcomer. Take a breath, Bailiff. Just a scribble, not one of Razandar's conspiracies. <laughs> uh, okay. That's a pretty cool looking blood splatter though. Only one of the lesser races would deface a beautiful wall like that. I mean no disrespect, but my statement rings true. Razam Dar claims the scribble contains a message of some sort, but I just don't see it. Do you know where I can find him? Hmm. The cat mentioned he was working with a newcomer. But if you ask me about Daedra, I'll toss you down a pit. As I told Razamdar, Somerset banished Daedric cult centuries ago. Our biggest problem right now concerns these wall scribblers. Well, you must have your work cut out for you then, huh? All right, I'll pay to clean up the wall if you tell me where I can find Raz. Is this a bribe? You know what? Just give it here. <laughs> the cat thinks the scribbles lead somewhere. Follow the news. Those were his last words before he darted off. At least, I think that's what he said. The nose knows. Alright, follow the nose. So I gotta... They're pointing me. Got it. Our prince accepts all kinds, and you'd be our first Khajiit. You'd be our first anything, actually. <laughs> Periite. So you guys are going to be stinkers, huh? Five Claw. You have the happy ability to know where to find Raz when Raz has need of you. <sighs> Getting information out of these Periite idiots is like squeezing milk from a stone. This is why Raz hates dealing with daydream cults. Raz, in your investigation of the cults, did you happen to find one devoted to Meridia? Interesting question. Raz has learned that the court of Bedlam has been attacking the cults of other princes, including those devoted to Meridia and Azura. Now, usually, if crazy cultists kill each other, it's good for Somerset. But this feels wrong. I need to talk to a priest of Meridia. You do? Well, Raz trusts you. So I can tell you about an old friend who attends Meridia ceremonies in the Eton near Grotto. Raz doesn't approve, but it's her life, yes? This one will make contact and meet you outside Eton near. I'll meet you there. Raz was planning to head up north to Eton near after talking to these Periite imbeciles anyway, to check on his old friend. The court of Bedlam's attacks on the other cults were particularly vicious, and this one worries so. Right, the Sigix captured a Mephala cultist. He says the priests are at war. Our oh, princes are at war. That would explain the attacks. Raz isn't an expert on Daedric cults, but this doesn't sound like their usual behavior. This one thought they just sort of left each other alone. The Court of Bedlam might have wiped out Meridia's cult with its attack. That's a terrible thing to say. No, <clears throat> Raz refuses to believe it. Raz's friend is a survivor. She's got to be all right. This one will go and make contact. Make sure she's fine. Then we'll meet you outside Eton near. Before you go, have you learned anything else about the Court of Bedlam? Raz hears things. He heard about the attacks on the rival cults. He heard that the court consists of followers of three different princes. And he heard that even though the High Elves constitute the majority of the court's members, 
There is one dark elf. One dark elf. Is that a, a is that dark significant? Elf among a group of high elves, seems significant to Raz. Besides, everyone seems to fear her, but this one could not dig up any details. We should keep an eye out for this dark elf. Yes. All right. Goodbye. Where are we going now? Where's this Etonir? Up here. Uh, just looking around a little bit. I feel like, didn't I come up here for something at some point? Ah. Oh well. Savior of Skywatch. That was the Dominion, though. Were there way shrines closer to that? Nope. Looks like I'm going for a run through the countryside. Well, at least I got my assault maneuvers. Running fast. Look at Cinder's little feet run. They're moving. Hey, there's a way shrine. No, I don't think I've been up here. Creeping around there. Over here, Five Claw. This is Raz's old friend, Sadarado. She follows Meridia, but do not hold that against her. <laughs> okay. Raz is pleased he was able to find Sadarado safe and uninjured. She has agreed to talk to you, so this one suggests you get to it, yes? Yes, I thought I was trying to talk to her. May Meridia's light shine upon you. Raz told me you need to contact my prince. With the recent attacks, however, I need to ask you what your interest in Meridia happens to be. We need Meridia's help to recover and repair the Dawnbreaker sword. Meridia's sword of light? I'm not sure I understand. Even if I wanted to help you, my efforts would probably be in vain. My prince doesn't speak to just any mortal. The leader of our sect had Meridia's ear, but... He was caught in a recent attack. Meridiated me in the past? She'll remember me. My prince blessed you with her presence. That's a story I'd love to hear sometime. Meridia, that was For in Cold Harbor. I'll do my best to help you, but the path to the shrine will be hazardous. Mephala's creatures still roam the area, feasting on my brothers and sisters. Tell me how to reach the shrine. Enter the grotto and look for our camp. Meridia's shrine looms over the area. Raz will accompany me and will enter via a side tunnel. I don't want you to have to worry about me while you're defending yourself against those creatures. So you're going to sneak through and avoid all the fighting while I go in the front door? Why could I not just go through the back door and avoid the fighting too? I'll meet you at the shrine. Raz this is dumb. This is a bad idea, Does not make sense. But yeah, anyway, so Meridia was... She helped during the main quest of uh, of the primary game. Going against Molag Ball, the 
Forces of Cold Harbor and all that. Uh, if you've played it at all, you should be f somewhat familiar about the main story because that's a starting area of the game. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, so Meridia helps you out towards the end of the main storyline. That's what the dialogue was referring to. Seeks in the Dark. Seems like a fitting name. Straight back, okay. You know what? I'm gonna go ahead and pick this up since I'm here. The Thieves Guild sent you. Hmm. Wouldn't go any deeper if I were you. Darkness crawls along the walls of Ethanir. Only thing you'll find here is an ugly death. That and the corpse of my former apprentice, most likely. What happened to your apprentice? No idea. Aerothal asked to take the lead, and I obligingly took a nap. Didn't <laughs> think it would be any trouble, even for a lackwit like her. Sneak past some cultists, grab the tokens, get out clean. Easy. But now, the place is swarming with Daedra. You think Aerothal is dead? Well, she's certainly missing, and I'm not risking my scaly hide going in to find her. Mm, you look scrappy enough. Mm. If you can grab those <laughs> tokens and what's left of my apprentice, I'll make it worth your while. All right, I'll what collect the tokens say? and look for. Her. Quest log is full. What? Uh. Clanumbra. Stormhaven. That's probably good enough. The thieves? Well, I suppose I could answer some questions. Long as they're quick. I don't suspect Aerothal will make it out alive. But there's no use prolonging the news. You don't seem too worried about her. What? Are you the kind of sap who sheds a tear for every idiot lost on a job? Huh? If you were so worried, what are you standing around here for? Go in and find her. Maybe she's still alive. Most likely not. But there's still a chance. Thought you said she was your apprentice. Not by choice. The guild shoved her in my lap and told me to start training. So far, all she's been good for is buzzing in my ear like some kind of mere gnat. Besides, I'm paying you to look for her, aren't I? Good enough. Fine, what about the cultists here? What happened to them? No idea. A cult of Meridia doesn't usually make a big splash. But here in Somerset, well, they don't look kindly on Daedric cults. Even the nice ones. Not surprised someone wanted them gone. Well, no matter to me, long as I get those tokens. Why does the guild want the tokens of Meridia anyways? Not entirely sure, truth be told. All I know is they're worth something to someone. Why that is, well, it's not my job to ask questions, long as I get paid. Alright, goodbye. Anyways, just picking it up so that I can complete it, but I'm not going to do it right now. I'm not going to do it on video, so let's see. We are on the Dreaming Cave. That's our main quest. If I happen to pick up those tokens as we go, I will, but I'm not going to go out of my way to do it. We're just straight in. Like there's some sort of explosion going on. Necrotic Horvor. Oh, my food wore off too. Look, tokens. Oh, hi, guys. Oh, that's right, I still gotta take my food.
Oh, dude, that guy just ran right past my fight. Oh, well. I don't really need to help. And I get the last one. Cool. This way. They're almost there. Guys is not fond of Daedric cultists. But no one Where's that? How did they get in over here? They struck us down without warning. I will try my best to get your friend an audience with the Lady of Light. The shrine is just inside. Okay. Oh, that's where the body is supposed to be. Okay. I'm not going there yet. Master, what did those bastards do to you? No, what they did to his body. They defiled Meridia Shrine. That life, that is not natural. Maridia, she goes to us. My devoted priest, a loyal soldier, and an intrepid instigator. <laughs> Step closer and bask in Maridia's light. Am I the intrepid investigator? Why is this statue talking to Raz? Should it be doing such a thing? How do I? There we go. My followers murdered. My shrine desecrated. The other princes, this so-called triad, they must answer for these insults. I think they got the same but voice I actor for this. this. In your mind. Speak, champion of Cold Harbor. Ask what you will of the Prince of Light. Uh, same voice actor from Skyrim, that is. From Meridia. Uh, your Golden Knight was captured and his sword damaged. We seek guidance on how to repair it. They dare to steal my vessel? To hold prisoner the agent I put in place to foil their despicable plans? <laughs> my light shall not be snuffed out. My colored runes will not be compromised. You must set Darien Gautier free. Darien? Is Darien? My vessel just thinks of itself as the mortal called Darien Gautier. In reality, Darien is my will and my power, inserted into your reality whenever my light needs to banish a darkness. I will admit my night changed after it met you, though. Uh, what do you mean he changed? The night had a single purpose, but somehow you complicated matters. <laughs> now the knight actually cares. You and my vessel will both be required to stop the triad. You must enter Mafala's realm and rescue Darien. Uh, I retrieved the Dawnstar gem. Can it be used to reforge Dawnbreaker? The gem cannot grow a new sword, but I can add to its power. Now you can use it to locate Darien in Mafala's realm. Return to the right master and tell him what I said. Wait, how dare they? The triad dares invade my sacred realm? This cannot stand. The triad's attacking your realm? Oh, dude, are your eyes bleeding? Meridia, my prince. They are. She's gone. I can't feel her presence any longer. Raz is certain that the nice statue will be fine. <laughs> Let this one take you someplace where you will be safe. Pretty sure I saw those eyes bleeding. Yep. Look at that. Anyways. Come on, Roz. Roz has seen many things. Where sharks, flying tigers. Where sharks on top of flying tigers, but they're talking light. What? Oh, Queen Irene will never believe it. Where sharks flying tigers, where sharks on flying tigers. That's pretty cool. Be honest with all the last. Uh, a lot. The Daedric Triad wants a crystal tower and they're attacking other princes. Too much honesty is never a good thing. How do we battle Daedric princes? Raz supposes an army will help. An army always helps. Alas. Raz rarely has an army to call upon when he needs one the most. 
course not. Right, Master will think of something. We just have to find Darien and repair the sword. And that involves traveling to places Raz never knew existed before all this started. No. Raz will see Sadara to safety and then do what he can to protect Somerset and the Crystal Tower. The Daedra fighting, Raz will leave to you, yes? Scaredy cat. <laughs> I'll do it. I never did turn on that timer. And I'm still not going to worry about that other quest. Let's get out of here, finish this main quest, and wrap up this video, I think. We're at half an hour now. Yeah, it's too far. I don't want to go that way. Whoa. Where did you come from? Did you just spit on me? How rude. Oh, you're still hiding out there in the dark, huh? Well, I'm going to leave you on your own. <laughs>